what is going on YouTube it's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'm going to show you how to bypass the 4.84 update on your PS3 now I have done this video before but a lot of people keep asking how do they bypass the update and all of that stuff even though I tell them that check on my channel playlist they keep asking so I am redoing the video over all right so all the links will be in the description make sure you guys go ahead and read through the description head over to the proxy server right here and download it the link will be in the description as I mentioned and you want to go ahead and save it in your local disk drive so save it in your local disk drive right here okay let me go back out save the proxy server right here in your local disk C Okay, so as you can see I saved it right here go ahead and right click and just extract it right there you're gonna end up with this folder right here so go inside the folder go all the way down to the PS3 proxy server GUI exe open as admin once the program open up you want to enter your IP address right here so what you can do is go down to the taskbar here type CMD enter and you want to type IP config press enter and you will see the IP4V ad address right here so this is the one you need to copy so just go ahead highlight it and copy it now paste it in right here once you paste the IP address right there click PS3 mode now after that click start now let's head over to the PS3 okay guys so now that we are on the PS3 let me just show you guys that I get greeted with the update message so if I try to sign signed in I'm gonna get the message saying that I need to update and also over on system update as you can see it's telling me to download the latest update if I go to system settings go all the way down that's my firmware right there 4.83 so let's go ahead now and show you guys what to do on the PS3 so go all the way down to network settings go to your internet connect connection settings press X go down to custom wireless press right right again right on the d-pad again keep pressing right on the d-pad until you come to the part that says proxy server right here go down to use and you want to go ahead and type in the same IP address from your computer type your computer IP address in the top line okay leave it as that then press right on the d-pad press right again press X now press circle and go back out now if I go over to signed up there you go as you can see guys I am now able to sign up without getting the message to update my PS3 so that's it guys it is as simple as that keep in mind that you will need to keep the proxy server running every time you do this keep it up and running every time you do this okay guys so guys if the video was helpful please leave a like also share the video around and also you can subscribe for more videos to come thank you for watching guys i will see you in my next video